Let's get. Yeah. Come. Come. And then I can get. You didn't bother to get up. Oh. <laughs> What's going on heroes? Welcome back to the vlog. So we are on our way to have Biscuit officially trained. This is actually going to be his first class because we are sick and tired of him just biting everything. I'm going to show you guys later on how he's destroyed the brand new sofa. Honestly, it, it's terrible. He's just ruined it completely and we're sick and tired of it. He bites everything. Shoes, counters, tables, the sofa everything he can get his his teeth on he'll bite and rip apart so we're sick and tired of it and we're taking him to get trained so he can stop biting stuff you're gonna be a good boy you're gonna be a good boy and go to school you better because we're not paying for nothing noodle head before you guys judge us we came to train him at petco okay okay i get that there's a stigma of training them at petco but i don't care this is the closest place to us and it's the most affordable place so we're bringing them to Petco to get trained. The lady just caught, she's getting her stuff together. Come on, Biscuit. Over to the training area? Yep. Okay. Yeah, I'll get these and I'll put it uh, in the Hang system on. and then we can start. Oh. You're in charge of doing the lessons? Okay. Let me look for the reason. Because he listens to me, he doesn't listen to you, so you need to take point on this. What do you want him to learn? Uh, roll. Roll over? Oh. What do you want Biscuit to learn? I don't think he understands what's about to happen, but he needs to be taught because, like I said, he just won't stop biting everything and it's very frustrating. Biscuit, how are you tired? You haven't done anything yet. All you did was walk out of the car and into the store. How are you tired already? He'll listen to him more than he'll listen to me. You guys can actually take off the leash since it's just you guys in okay. the training area. What I'm going to show you, it's going to be a little bit helpful, helpful for you since he doesn't really listen. Let's get, let's get. What we're going to do is we're going to put Come the here. treat on his nose. Good boy, good boy. And then we're on his nose. Come. He's going to follow me. Yes. Let's get. Yeah. Come. Come. Man, I can get you. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't hear Father pick it up. Oh, <laughs> we'll try so it again. Don't worry. Let's make sure he's moving and he's not dragging his body. Yeah, he does not want to listen to Vivian. Enough. And that's one of the problems because he only listens to me and not to them. That's why Vivian is the one doing the clash right now because she needs to be able to control him when I'm not around. Think of it sitting so he can go down. Down. Yeah. Close to his paws. Close to his paws. Yeah. Down. Perfect. Yes. Yes. He's paying a lot more attention. He's finally listening to her. It's Down. the reward of him getting the tea while he's actually doing what she wants him to do. So it's positive reinforcement. So as long as she keeps on doing it on a consistent basis, then he should be okay and listening because as you guys can see, he's very attentive right now. Relax. Yeah. I was holding until he was. Why are you holding I think the class went pretty well. Um, Vivian was able to learn a lot of things that she didn't know, was able to learn and lure him with some treats. Vivian, what did you take away from that class? On how to reward him, yeah, I gotta buy him a bunch of treats. <laughs> and what do we have so far? We have this Kong Ex Extreme because he loves to bite. Uh -huh. Because he loves to bite and he just, you need to put some stuff in it. And then we also get in a sweet potato recipe that you basically squeeze inside this hole so that he can struggle and bite on it and then um, get, get the some. treat out so whenever he starts biting stuff because that's one of his main problems is that he just starts biting everything destroying everything so if he starts biting stuff that means he's bored and he needs to get entertained and that's why we need to get on those treats um one step at a time i just want to give you guys a quick little update on biscuits prolapse and honestly he's been doing really good he hasn't been bleeding it's probably been about a month and a half and he hasn't bled at all not spotted i don't know if you guys remember the last time we talked about his prolapse he kept having issues where he was still spotting everyone he was bleeding anytime he would get excited but since then when we took him back to um the vet they checked him out they they put some stuff on him basically and they gave us some stuff for infection and since then he's been pretty pretty good and he hasn't been picking at it he hasn't been bleeding spotting or anything if you guys see 
he's generally in good terms. He even if he gets excited um, and jumps on people and this little stuff comes out, it doesn't bleed, which is awesome. And we just got him this cool little toy where he's able to chew, so it stops him from biting everything. We came to Chinatown to Fu Chow. That's right over there. Uh, right over there to come eat because they have really good food and I don't know if you guys know this but they actually filmed the fight scene from Rush Hour 1 here right right at that place there's a lot of damn cars passing by because the freeway's right up ahead look see that food chow restaurant Food is finally here and honestly it all looks great. Check this out, we got the vegetable chow mein, sauteed string beans, tofu vegetables, chicken fried rice, chicken fried rice, and then the veggie rolls. It all looks so good. We just got home, everybody's shower. As you can see, I just got out the shower. It's been a really long day. There was a lot of things that I missed because unfortunately something's going on with this camera and the battery. This is the second time where the battery is showing that it has 30% or more, and then it just keeps dying saying that the battery is low. So unfortunately um, this vlog is gonna be a little bit weird because it just cuts off at one point and then here I am talking to you about being home and the rest of the day just over. So there's nothing else that's really gonna happen. Like I said, we already shower, we're just gonna relax and then head to bed. So with that, thank you guys for watching. Make sure to hit the like button, make sure to subscribe, and we'll see you guys next time. Peace.